Lamb was directed by Valdemir Johansson and stars Nomi Rapaz and is the new A24 film that a lot of people are talking about and how bizarre and odd it is. I think not many people are ready for this film in particular because it's something that's not for everyone for one. And a lot of the times when people generally see the trailers for A24 films, they have some sort of expectations. But when it comes to this film in particular, <laughs> it's a huge left turn, it's a detour, and it drives many different directions. The cinematography in this film is absolutely gorgeous and breathtaking to look at. The film is split into chapters, chapter one, chapter two, and chapter three. I think it's really cool that in the middle of nowhere, they capture all these animals in this farm, and the story is pretty much just about the people and just about the animals as well. The film is also quite silent. By silent, I mean that it has very little dialogue and just moments of silence that you have to interpret in your own way. So it has many different interpretations, it has many different representations for the film. However, it's very interesting the use of sound in this film, the use of silence in this film, and the way you look at it from a different perspective. A lot of the film is generally centered around the score, the sound effects, the sound editing. So if you're coming into this film a casual moviegoer, you're not going to enjoy it for the most part because there's not much dialogue, but it's very much a slow burn, it's very slow paced, but it has a huge appreciation of the wilderness surrounding the story. The lighting, of course, in this film is beautiful. The use of shadows, the use of natural sunlight, and, and the cloudiness, it's beautiful to look at. As I said, the film is very slow paced and it centers around the humans and the animals, but the thing is, a lot of the times you wish you want the characters to say something, but they don't, but it just stays on a few shots and lingers on and then goes more and more into building up the suspense and the thrills for the story. A lot of the representations and metaphors explored in this film has to do with a lot of biblical meanings or stories and myth mythological stories as well. It's all up to you. It's more very ambiguous and it's very interpretational, but the thing is with the film is that you would have to decipher it on your own and go through many different analysis and viewings too as well. But the ending of this film really changes the whole tone of the movie and I didn't know what to feel about it until I sat down and I really looked into the execution and the way the story was built up until that moment. But it's gonna leave viewers very puzzled and confused on where it went towards the end with the ending but I'm not gonna give any spoilers away but let me know in the comments down below what you think about the ending. I think that the casual moviegoer would not like this film. Like I said this film is not for everyone. I'm going to give Lamb a B minus. So guys what did you think about Lamb? Did you like it? Did you hate it? What are some of your favorite A24 movies by the way? I love A24 and what they distribute. A lot of the films, yeah, are a little hit and miss, but for me, I generally lean towards the horror side. As I said, I love A24. I'd love to hear your thoughts down below. Please don't forget to like and comment, and please hit the subscribe button and the bell to get notified when I upload new videos. I hope you guys are doing well and you're having a great day, and I can't wait to hear from you very soon. Peace out.